Hi friends today I will talk about optical fiber. What is fiber optics? We're used to the idea of information traveling in different ways. When we speak into a landline telephone, a wire cable carries the sounds from our voice into a socket in the wall, where another cable takes it to the local telephone exchange. Cell phones work a different way. They send and receive information using invisible radio waves, a technology called wireless because it uses no cables. Fiber optics works a third way. It sends information coded in a beam of light down a glass or plastic pipe. It was originally developed for endoscopes in the 1950s to help doctors see inside the human body without having to cut it open first. In the 1960s, Engineers found a way of using the same technology to transmit telephone calls at the speed of light, normally that's 186,000 miles or 300,000 kilometers per second in a vacuum, but slows to about two-thirds this speed in a fiber optic cable. Cable Optical Technology Fiber Optic Cables a fiber optic cable is made up of incredibly thin strands of glass or plastic known as optical fibers. One cable can have as few as two strands or as many as several hundred. Each strand is less than a tenth as thick as a human hair and can carry something like 25,000 telephone calls, so an entire fiber optic cable can easily carry several million calls. Fiber optic cables carry information between two places using entirely optical, light-based, technology. Suppose you wanted to send information from your computer to a friend's house down the street using fiber optics. You could hook your computer up to a laser, which would convert electrical information from the computer into a series of light pulses. Then you'd fire the laser down the fiber optic cable. After traveling down the cable, the light beams would emerge at the other end. Your friend would need a photoelectric cell, light detecting component, to turn the pulses of light back into electrical information his or her computer could understand. So the whole apparatus would be like a really neat, high-tech version of the kind of telephone you can make out of two baked bin cans and a length of string. String How Fiber Optics Works a fiber optic cable bent around in a loop with red light shining down it. How total internal reflection keeps light rays inside a fiber optic cable. Light travels down a fiber optic cable by bouncing repeatedly off the walls. Each tiny photon, particle of light, bounces down the pipe like a bobsleigh going down a nice run. Now you might expect a beam of light, traveling in a clear glass pipe, simply to leak out of the edges. But if light hits glass at a really shallow angle, less than 42 degrees, it reflects back in again, as though the glass were really a mirror. This phenomenon is called total internal reflection. It's one of the things that keeps light inside the pipe, at the pipe. <laughs>